Hi everyone, it's Jo from Plan to Create. Welcome to my channel. Today we are doing um, part of a series which will be a different layout each week in the 2022 Hobonichi Weeks, which I have here in the Gilio Slimmer Punto in Croco Charcoal Matte. Uh, and Dandelion is the name of the cover. I could not think of it last week. Okay, so we're in December, so I'm going to be using a Christmas kit from I Love to Print on Etsy. Uh, so we've got the three sheets of stickers, which is way too much. Okay, I will show you how this week is going. Let's get in a bit closer. Just set the lighting a little bit. Okay, so I did a task list on the side and just marked off uh, on the days that I did it. And on the left hand side, I just had the main um, priorities for the day, any appointments uh, and things like washing um, the bins out, the usual suspects as I like to call them. So that worked quite well. But this week we're going to turn it sideways and we're gonna do a vertical spread. So each week, um, I'm not sure for how many weeks, but I'm gonna try and do a different layout each week. Um, just to give you some different layout ideas. Okay, so we'll start off with our day covers as per usual. Now I'm currently working on a video. I've got, I've had a lot of queries. I've got a, a Louis Vuitton browser wallet, which I have used as a cover for a Hobonichi Weeks previously. So that video will show you how you can do it because the Hobonichi Weeks isn't exactly the right size for it. Um, but I'll show you three different ways in which you can use it. Okay, so even though we're gonna go vertically, I'm still gonna put down uh, the washi tape because it's still gonna Give us a bit of a frame. Oh, the Queen of Crooked is definitely back. For those of you that are new, um, I call myself the Queen of Crooked because I'm not very good at laying stickers down and I blame being left-handed for that. <laughs> That's my logic anyway and I'm going to stick to it. Okay, I'll also pop these up at the top. I don't really look at the week numbers so just to give it a bit of a a bit of a frame it's very awkward to do things um, under the camera that's my excuse okay now we better get the dates going before I forget so I'll be using uni jet stream ballpoint in 0 0.7 with a black ink so Monday is the 6th. Okay, now I've just penciled out a little section down here, which I will get my pen out and fix that up. Just need to grab a bigger ruler for this section here. So I'll just rule this one up. Now, I've split it up. Let's see if we can get in a bit closer. Let the light adjust. Um, I'm going to have Happy Mail next week. I'm going to do a sleep tracker because I'm having lots of trouble sleeping. Uh, and a notes section. So, we'll rule these up. And a little, oh, I need to move over a little bit here. Okay. So I have my Tombow um, 
eraser. It's got an eraser on one end and wide out on the other. And I love it. So we've got Happy Mail. We have Next Week. We have Sleep and Notes. Okay, so for the sleep section, I've just got the days of the week and um, numbers on the side. So I'll put the days of the week in. And I've done from 4 to 10, as in how many hours. So we've got 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 10 is very ambitious. Um, <laughs> For me, uh, we're approaching summer at the moment, or we're in summer actually, and in Australia, and I live in the country, and my cats <sighs> have started bringing in frogs, mice, um, it's been a few mice of late, and frogs, and they bring them in in the middle of the night, and the frogs scream, it's horrible. Um, so I end up having to get up out of bed and saving the um, frogs. I catch them um, with whatever I can, a jar or whatever, and then pop them outside. So that does not help with my sleep situation, I can tell you. Okay, so just at the bottom of that tracker, I'm just going to squish in a smaller tracker there just for my meds and that's pretty much all I mainly track so <clears throat> there we go all right now uh, let's check our monthly I'm pretty sure I don't have anything on for next week yet and silly me I put the dates on the wrong way. I wanted the Monday on this side. What I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to get my undo, take that off and then turn it around and put it the right way. So I'll do that off camera because um, that'll take me a little while. Okay, so we'll pretend this is Monday for now. I'm going to put in some little uh, trackers for... Let's see, we might have to turn it around a bit. Now, do I do that or not? Because that takes up a lot of room. No, I don't think I will do that. I might put in just some boxes up at the top for the main priorities for the day. So we'll put those all along the top. Okay, so instead of using the, the little checklists, I'll just pop in um, the main thing that I want to get done for the day. Now, there are some really pretty um, sort of full boxes. So I am going to, I think I might just stagger them. Now, they're designed to fit that way. So they're going to go over a little bit which is fine so I will put those every couple of days now I'm not worried about not having enough room um, to write down tasks because we also have this section down the bottom so that's why I didn't use up whoops I didn't use up the whole uh, of this page to do all of this stuff so we'll run down like so so I know say tomorrow we need to get a new range hood for our kitchen so I'll pop that one in get new range hood because our current one has died 
and then we're gonna have coffee I know I've got to do a book list order for my son's school next year so and then I'll just carry on uh, down the page okay so for happy mail I do have quite a few things coming in so let's see we've got uh, notebook therapy I've got some stencils coming and they're in the country so hopefully well they've arrived in Australia um, so hopefully they'll be here soon uh, I've got tickled pink planning what else have we got uh, stickers for you by Kate I have a jet pens order and I also have another Hobonichi order. I know, I was naughty. I'll do an unboxing when I get it. Um, but yes, I have done another order. Okay, so for the following week, I've got some notes to put down. So the 15th, is when my booster shot is due so I've got to make an appointment for that and then also on the 15th so I won't be doing both on the same day but at 2 45 I've got my hair cut and color so I don't want to forget those all right, so, <clears throat> excuse me, what I might do up the top section is pop in my usual suspects, as I call them. So, on the Tuesday, we have bin day, uh, Wednesday and Saturday, we have washing. So, I'll find my washing stickers. This is um, my... Uh, reusable sticker book from Lime and Mortar. Uh, I do have them with little tabs on them, but there we go. So washing. Do I have anything that matches the colours? Not really. Um, I think these ones might be a little bit... Let me squish that in. I think we can squish that in and there's a green one so for the Saturday and on Thursday I want to film for YouTube Monday Tuesday Wednesday Thursday And then I'm going to put another one on Sunday. I'm trying to get two videos out a week, but last week I could only get out one. So Thursdays I normally pop in a computer just to signify do some work in the shop. And I think, let's see if we can get in a little bit. I think we might leave it at that. I think that looks good. Though if there was one other thing I was going to do, uh, this kit comes with some full strips. So I thought it would be nice just to pop one to separate um, where I've got my little tables down here. And slice off that end bit, trying not to get my buffet in the frame. Need a ruler. There we go. Okay, so we're all framed out. I wonder, because I've put that sticker so low, I don't know if I will be able to fit. Let's have a look. Will this other strip fit down the bottom? We should be able to squish it. Just to totally frame that out.
Okay. There we go. So that looks a bit better. So when you open it up the normal way, so we've got last week and or this week and next week. I think that looks pretty good. Hopefully it'll be a practical uh, layout. Alrighty, I think I'll leave that as it is. Um, I do post updated um, photos of the spreads on my Instagram. So if you uh, want to check out how they turn out, uh, my Instagram is listed below. Alrighty, well thank you so much for stopping by. Love it if you could give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you like and I'll see you soon with another. Bye.